Gwen Stefani shutting down rumors she and Blake Shelton are getting divorced. I was like, what? That's crazy. I want to do everything with him every day. So anytime we can be together, perform, write songs, hang out, watch TV, whatever it is, I, I'm all about Blake. In a new interview with Nylon Magazine, the singer flat out says all that gossip is just lies. Okay, stop. This is bananas. Telling the mag that the truth is the truth, and we know what that is. Blake saved my life. Everybody knows that. Gwen and Blake's love story began in 2014 when they met as coaches on The Voice. Both of our lives had basically fallen completely apart, and little did we know it happened to both of us at the same time. Yeah. It's so much incredible miracles came out of being on the show for me, so I just feel so blessed that I got this whole experience and got that guy. Whoa. Boom, hello. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Fast forward to now, Gwen has no doubt about their relationship, saying the truth is I am in love with my best friend. Looking in your eyes now, if I had to die now, I don't love nobody but you. But she's also human and just like the rest of us, admits you still create drama in your mind about your insecurities. Now Gwen's turning those feelings into new music. I knew the day I wrote Purple Irises, I needed to be truthful to myself and write this song about, I'm getting older, I don't feel pretty. If I don't feel pretty, how could someone else think I'm pretty still? What if like somebody tries to take my love away from me and I really wanted to show how insecure I, I could feel. She says her latest collab with Blake, Purple Irises, is a testament of their bond. The real truth is that you're in the garden with your your best friend picking purple irises that you planted in 2020 and now you're picking them together and you have this like amazing friendship, marriage. But Gwen says writing the song was no easy feat. I told this to Blake the other day, you don't understand, to be a mom and a wife and then write a record, it's so hard to squeeze it into the life that I have. It's just different now because I just, I'm writing, but it's hard to do. When you're a kid and you're writing, you're like, you have all this time and you can stay up all late and it's like, it's, you can self indulge in yourself. And you're a little I'm like now. just trying to find like pockets of time to make music and it still never gets old. It's still so exciting and, you know, magical. Part of that magic is reuniting with her bandmates, no doubt, for Coachella. Gwen's been sharing glimpses at how they're preparing. The fact that we're going to be at Coachella, I've never played at Coachella before. I think it's just going to be one of those things like riding a bike. We're just going to get up there and look at each other and like start laughing and going, what? <laughs> I can't wait.